Hello and welcome back to Shadows of Doubt. I uh, figured a nice way to start this episode off would be to uh, do a little bit of home improvement. And actually, I gotta say, it wasn't easy finding my own apartment. Um, it, like for real, um, it was weird. You know what? Uh, let me let me do a little bit of house cleaning. We're gonna archive and close this case. Um, close it. You'll lose all pinned information on your board. That's fine. Um, we've we've got a good archive of it uh, via you know our our my YouTube series at the very least. Can change the core of your apartment using the inventory menu. Yeah, I want to do that in just a second. I'm gonna close some of these cases. There might be good reason to keep it open in the future, but uh, eh, whatever. If you need cash, check out the notice boards. Look, I'm not saying I approve, but there's one of those starch cola sync discs in your mailbox. I forgot about that. Let's go check that out real quick. This is a Novak house first floor, no, a basement three Novak house. Let's go check that out real quick. Novak house, basement three, basement one, two, three. Sync disc. A one-off payment of 5,000 credits will be credited to your account. Disclaimer, uninstall cost is 6,000. Consumption of starch cola products will reduce the uninstall cost by 5 credits. Uh, this is an awful, awful sync disc. I hate it. <laughs> pass. Hard pass. I hate that. <laughs> oh, that is that is truly miserable. Okay, let's uh, let's do a little bit of house improvement. Um, I, I don't mind spending a bit of money on this. Let's get some, uh, I like rustic brick. There we go. We have some options for color. We can make it dirtier or not. Preview rustic brick. I don't know what, if this does anything. Ew. What is this? Oh, wow. It can make it look really dirty. Really nasty. The, the dirt doesn't seem to do much. I like this. This looks pleasantly horrible. All right, so that's the walls done. Uh, there's lots of options for walls, I have to say. It's quite nice. Um, let's pick some nice floor. I don't want anything too nice. Something delightfully miserable, you know? Concrete. I actually honestly think that what we've got right now isn't awful. Wooden floor painted. We can choose different colors. This looks too nice, honestly. I think what we've got right now is, is kind of perfect. Okay, furnishings. We got a cork board. Nice. I like it. Um, is that all we got for furnishings? That's a, well, all we've got for room, storage, shop. Oh, we can... Okay, so we can buy some stuff. We can buy a bedroll. I wouldn't mind having an actual bed. I think that's the one thing I'd like to... Oh, we can get a, we can get a hanging basket. How do, we, how do we place that? Uh... Move all the storage. No, I don't. I want to I wanna buy some stuff. I think that some of this is not exactly implemented. I keep saying that, but I don't know. Room. Storage. Shop. Yeah, it's like not letting me buy stuff yet. Uh, can we... We can place a note. Um, a bulb. Kettle, calendar, fits, fizz soap pads, clothes basket. Do you want to purchase this? Yeah. There we go. We've got a clothes bag basket. All is is right in the world. Now I wouldn't mind actually having a city directory. Where we put that, I'm not sure. Just it just fell through the floor. 
All right, well, that's gonna conclude the decorating portion of this uh, episode. Let's go ahead and, uh, you know, I actually really wanted to, um, one of the reasons I wanted a bed was because I wanted, what do you mean kerosene? <laughs> Uh, I really wanted to just like sleep until uh, a murder case turns up Dome ceiling lamp typewriter office light lamp um, Can I seriously we can buy a micro cruncher. I'd actually love like I'd love to buy some of this stuff But it really seems like it's not doable right now the, the this does not feel feature complete but that's okay. We'll just have to find a park bench or something I can I can sleep on. You know, like a real detective. Uh, we're in an apartment. Usually there is a bench or some kind of thing I can sit on to pass the time. Clears throat. What do you what do you have to say? Do you have something you want to say to me? Say it to my face. Okay, I'm not seeing any park, any benches. I know it's an apartment, but I did see a bench in in an apartment. I'm not losing my mind here. Um. Okay. I guess we um. I think we can just like wait. Let's like uh sit outside this fire. Here and then um, how come I can't open my inventory right now? I'm pressing the right button. My God, can can I have something work, please? Here we go. <laughs> Watch. Um, I thought I could wait with this. Yeah, I mean, the buttons are not working. I actually, you know, the funny thing is, that I actually loaded recently. Um, all everything that happened in the last episode is no longer canon. Because I actually loaded it out of, um, out of, out of existence. But yeah, I'm, I'm actually really struggling right now. It won't let me wait. It's, it's almost like I, yeah, pass time while sitting down. Oh, I see. I have to sit down. Okay, let's try and find somewhere to sit. And there's a park bench. I wanted to sit near the fire so I wouldn't freeze to death. But sure, let's sit down. Pass time. Um... Let's wait a day. Set alarm. Yeah, I'm gonna be really cold and wet and I might even die, who knows. I wonder if there's a limitation to how cold you can get in this game. It doesn't seem like it. You strolled down the wrong street, pal. Give me your crows. Not a chance. You'll regret this decision. Okay. Still can't open my inventory, by the way. I still have my trench in, though. I can't get up, either. There we go. What do you mean, potential fine? This was... This was self-preservation. Well, I'm leaving. My goodness. The rules of the city certainly are working backwards, aren't they? Okay, so I can press three to open up my uh, my watch. All right, let's sit down again and try and pass some time again. January, I wanna be on January 5th. If I get robbed again, I swear to God. We're hungry, we're thirsty, we're cold, we're wet. The moods are matching the city, you know? I should certainly hope someone dies soon so that I can, I have something to do. I could try taking on another side mission, but I really just, 
I feel like all of that is kind of a mess. I, uh, I theorize that one of the reasons that the, um, my, my, the mission would not succeed in the last episode is because it kept telling me to pick up a, a find a lost briefcase or the, uh, the hidden briefcase. I think that when I picked up that phone call after I failed the case and it t gave me the next step of the mission, it had kind of hung the whole process, like kind of kiboshed everything. Um, because it was stuck at find the briefcase, but yet it was telling me what to do next. Um, so I, I think the whole thing was kind of kiboshed. That's why I loaded. There are definitely some game breaking glitches right now. Uh, I still think that this game is worth it despite all of that. It's a very difficult game to, to you know, nail down perfectly. And I think that, um, I think the devs are doing their best and I, and I appreciate what's here already. Um, is there no murders? No murders happening? We got a nice uh, thunderstorm to keep us company. Okay, we are no longer okay. We could definitely use a meal or something. Vending machine. Uh, what is this? A one-off payment for uh, 5,000 credits. No, we're not going to take that. I'll buy this cola and drink it. That'll at least get us part of the way there. Well, we're not going to be wet or hungry anymore. Uh, let's buy some food. Fried chicken? Yeah. Thanks. I, I still can't open my inventory, by the way. That's, uh, that's a real problem. I have to open it via the cork board, which is very strange. Why am I still dying? Okay, I'm no longer dying. All right, let's take a mission. Apartment for sale, 1200. I guess we could get a legitimate, um... Oh, hey, that's my old apartment right there. 303 Gomez house. 3,800, huh? Wow. How much money do I have? 2,600 credits. I could buy this apartment. Sure, let's buy an apartment. Maybe uh, maybe the re one of the reasons I can't decorate my current place is because I don't actually own it. Low price due to o odor. <laughs> Yo, that's pretty good. Okay. Now, I do wonder if it will actually update the directory to uh, match my new apartment. Let's look at oats. Rose building. There it is. We'll have a quick look at it. My dude is going to be slipping and sliding real quick. We have made a little bit of money, which is nice. And we're in the Rose Building. I think the Rose Building is a nice one. Should have worn, worn a scarf. I wonder if you can get some clothing. I do wonder, like, what are the plans for... Um... Am I in the basement again? Uh, like, equipment in the future? Like, there's sync discs right now? Well, this place is actually kind of nice compared to what I was... Oh, the, the light flickers. Let's try... Um, let's try cleaning this place up a bit. I think I'm stuck. Like, the inventory is stuck right now. Edit decor. Uh, yeah, it's, like, fully stuck. Might try reloading the game. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Just give me a second. Okay, it seems... Uh, reloading has seems to have fixed the problem. I can open up the apartment decor. Um, I wonder if I could maybe buy some furnishings now. Do you think? Do you think I could do that? I would really like to do that. Um, like, let's try a shelf. Hey! All right, we've got shelves, buddy. 
Yeah, confirm that. No, we're playing we're playing the Sims now. We're playing the Sims now, buddy. Okay. Um yeah, I want a clock. So it takes a second to load. Can I Okay. Preview. I'm not going to mess with like, you know, colors or anything like that, but I am going to I am going to furnish, you know? I want to furnish. I like this poster, but I, I I want the cork board. That's something I definitely want. I don't think that it has any function. This uh, this is very hit or miss right now. Confirm. Um, and I want a bedroll. Like again, it it seems to work every other time. Um, crank that dirt. Here you go. I'm going to sleep in the corner right over here. You got to sleep in one corner so that, uh, you know, you keep your soil on the other side. I'm sorry that that's, you know, that's truly next level disgusting, but, um, you know, it, it, it's kind of the vibe we're going for. I'm afraid hanging basket. I want a hanging basket. That's one thing I want. Okay. Like, let me have the hanging basket. Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful. It's the one nice thing we have, you know? I'm gonna have two of them. Won't let me place another one, huh? Okay. Oh, and you know what? I do want a coat stand. Place to hang my hat, you know? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Place to play, hang my hat and coat. So it can fall through the floor and through the world. Nice. Uh, okay. I mean, there's other things I'd like to get as well, but um, that's good for now. Office cubicle would be kind of cool, actually. Hey, it didn't. It, it worked the first time. Can we rotate it? I kind of like this. Oh, it won't let me do it do it like that. I kind of wanted to phase it through the wall like that. And then I could have the cork board like, you know. Let's have it like this and that way um, I kind of have a wall between me and, and the bed. You know, like I, I feel, almost feel like I have a bedroom. It's not like I, I like, you know, I promise I don't live like this in real life, you know. Okay, items. We could have a desk lamp. I, I'd like to do maybe a bit more of this later. Now that is now that it's actually working for me, uh, I would definitely like to have a micro cruncher. Let's at least have a micro cruncher, okay? There we go. In our desk, and um, you know, if we're gonna have a micro cruncher, we should have a office chair. I'm not going to have a nice office here. In fact, the least, the less I spend on this, the better. Let's just buy like a stool, maybe. Even the stool looks kind of too nice, honestly. Plastic stool, perfect. Confirm. Put down. There we go. That, that is our setup. And boy, howdy, does it look good. So let's, uh, I'm kind of interested to see, um... Oh, new murder case. Hey, that was good timing. We were just about done. Case opened. Explore. Uh, resolution hall. Okay. But I am, I just want to take a, oh, what's my passcode? Um, five, six, seven, eight. Do I have a passcode? All right, well, we'll have to figure that out later. I might have to hack into my own <laughs> account. We could buy a numbers cruncher. That's not a bad idea. All right, let's um, explore reported crime scene. 1502 Stubbs Deluxe. Yeah, Stubbs Deluxe seems to be a magnet for crime, you know? But I'm just happy to be back on the job. You know, it's 
Uh, it's a it's a it's a kind thing that murderer did giving me more stuff to do I wonder if I'm headed towards the uh, city hall right now to get the uh, yeah I think I am just to get the uh, slip that's fine I know uh, someone mentioned that I run around too often and uh, I miss stuff. You know, I, I'd like to argue maybe for a moment that um, n not everything is functioning as intended in this game. And so it's hard to, you know, know exactly what I'm missing. Um, but I, I think that I, I am pretty thorough. At least I know somewhat what I'm looking for. Um, but, well, you know, I'll try and slow down a little bit when uh, when I get to places of interest for sure. All right, so we're going to 1502 Stubbs Deluxe. Um, I don't know how to get there. I mean, I'd have to find Stubbs Deluxe. There's Novak. I know it's fairly close to uh, Indigo. No, nope, that's Gomez. Pretty sure that's uh, Rose over there. Rose, yep, that's Rose. <clears throat> like I say, I'll get to know this uh, town a bit, you know, more in depth. But I've walked, I've gone to Stubbs Deluxe so many times, and yet I don't seem to be able to. I, I don't remember where it is. And a lot of these buildings tend to look the same, for good reason. There's not really much reason to to make them look distinct from one another. Again, that's Gomez. This might be it here. Yeah, Stubbs Deluxe. Here we go. So we're looking for 1502 Stubbs Deluxe. I have been getting some good advice um, from people. Um, my concern is like, you know, I, I, I think that this game should be treated like a, a simulator, but also kind of like a role playing game. My hope is that they go role-playing game with it a little bit like yes there are mechanical there's there's mechanical progress but i'd also like to you know i'd like to get into the mood of this world a bit more um and so like i don't necessarily want to find um objective correct like methods for for doing things 1502 well, that's 1501 right there Enforcers open up. Oh, hello. You're already here. I did hear that the the glitch for like phasing through walls when you uh, when you get up from a chair was fixed. Let's let's test that theory out. Yeah, seems to have been. Oh, geez. Is that not a little bit extreme? Don't mind me. Ow. <laughs> Shut your trap. Well, I mean, I just wanted to have a look around. Ain't nothing, you know, more innocent than that, honestly. could go into the vent but you know where I'm going back to 1502 that's right because I am not giving up 
I am not a person or, or they that gives up. Oh, good lord. This is new. Okay, well, let's, um... Oh, I don't have a camera anymore. No, I was going to take a picture. Okay, what do we got? Work rota. Pin it. Body. Inspect it. Pin it. Take prints. We got them prints. Okay. Um, search. Analysis. A bullet wound. 8 millimeter. It appears that the victim has been shot to death with a pistol or revolver. Can determine the time of death is between 1630 and 1745. Wednesday, January 4th. So, about an hour ago. We don't have a lot of time. Can we take a blood sample? We got to type Y. I'm not sure what her finger. She's type Z. Hey, didn't I inspect a type? Z? Oh no, that never mind. That was in an alternate universe that doesn't exist anymore. We've got expended revolver car cartridges. Six of them. Seven of them. Sure wish I had a camera right now. Because, like, God, if that ain't a, a good picture right there. Type Z. That would be our unknown citizen, which we will get um, more on soon enough. Wait, type Y. Type Y on that. Um, we gotta know, we need to know more. We need to find the wallet. Type Z. We've got a lamp. We've got a filing cabinet. Files. Perfect. No? Nothing in there? Hmm. Type Z. What do we got in here? Type Y. Um, type Z is our victim, so let's assume for the time being that type Y is our killer. And I like to put just like a question mark on it. That way I don't have to um, dis make uh, the, the, connection, uh, the, the connections ambiguous. Nothing in there yet. Haven't found. Okay, there's our safe. Type Y. Seems that type Y uh, was interested in the safe. Is this a... No, that's a Bible. Nothing of interest there. I haven't found any information on the victim yet. Ah, here we go. There's our purse with the key. We got Sherla Pema. Charlotte Pema, I should say. 1502 Stubbs Deluxe. Good, good, good. Let's just go ahead and organize things a little bit. Um, we got a work ID, work at Dragon Burger. We can check their work out. It's usually a good source. Oh, Dane Beckford work rota. Is that something 
Did I, I, I know, I guess I found that, but I didn't really look at it too hard, did I? Dame Beckford. Well, that could be our type Y. We'll definitely look into that soon enough. What we got in here? Money. Remember your password this time. Your password code is Charlotte's year of birth. Which is, do we know that yet? Date of birth is, uh, 1947. Let's try that on the safe first. There we go. Sync discs. Receive 10% to discount on all shop items. Uh, alter height. Oh, man. Uh, that's good. Barging doors now always takes... Uh, only one attempt. Remove all fall damage. I'm definitely going to take some of this stuff. Wait, what? Sync disk contains DNA sequence that may can be installed. Oh, right. Okay. Inventory full. Right. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's go ahead and put this some of this stuff in here. Remember, this is an old save, so uh, I have stuff that I've already dropped previously. Go ahead and drop a couple of videotapes from a different timeline into the safe. Uh, I guess the sync disc is interesting. I'll take it. Um, so we have a code. Let's check out the micro cruncher. Got some more drawers here I didn't find. We got a key. Nothing in there. Oh, so Dana Becker, Beckford, Dane Beckford uh, works or lives here. 1947. That's not it. Oh, is it for Dane then? Oh, okay, that's Dane's passcode. Let's look at the V-mail. Pass control requests, reminder. Don't forget to pick up milk. Same, same old, same old. Lunch date. So it looks like Dane Beckford um, was actually the spouse, potentially. This is to Char Charlotte Penna. Yeah, so uh, Dane Beckford and Charlotte Penna were spouses. I'll print this out. There's generally no reason to do that, but I like to do it for uh, just to be thorough, you know? Okay. Um, profile. We have a profile on Dane Beckford. She also lives here. This was obvious, but, uh, you know. We also have a, uh, you know, we know what they look like. Uh, anything else interesting in there? It doesn't look like it. Not really seeing anything else. So we're looking for a gun. We did uh, steal quite a lot of stuff, didn't we? I'm pretty sure I have inspected the body as much as I can and I've got her print. And all of that stuff. I wonder, like, it, it seems to me you should be able to take blood type as well. Oof. I have now disturbed the, uh, the crime scene. What is this? Work rota for Charlotte Penna? Um, so... Type Y. Let's check out this um, weapons dealer. Business. I mean, that feels very, you know, obvious. May as well check the... Oh, wow, there's blood in here as well, huh? This is a mess. Uh, 
this uh this place is not cool not good anymore they'll uh it'll be it'll be difficult to rent it out to someone else you know Okay, um, just making sure I find... Okay, here we go. Storage box files. Good to know. Um, from the desk of Lydia Balog for Dane Beckford at 1502 for treatment of high blood pressure, daily insulin. Okay, this is this stuff is generally not very, you know, useful, but good to have it. Sometimes you can find f fingerprints in here. Tenancy agreement. Certificate of birth. I mean, that's something. We have um, birth certificate of uh, Dane Beckford. It seems to me I should be able to um, sample blood that I find on the ground. It doesn't seem like that's a thing that's implemented just yet. Is this another spent cartridge? Yep. I already looked at these. Okay, so, um, you know, I'm just trying to be as thorough as possible. Oh, is that a crumpled piece of paper? Let's play. Oh, no. Oh god, okay. What what could that be? Um That's I mean that's pretty disturbing. What is this? Take this item. Um I'm going to take it. And the reason I'm going to take it inventory full. I mean that makes sense. Uh, I'm just going to drop this for the time being. I want to take it so I can inspect it. Or scan it, I suppose, for fingerprints. Ah, type AA. Okay, so that kind of rules out... Not not fully, but it kind of rules out um, Dane Beckford for now. Which we we can safely assume that Dane Beckford is this type Y. So I may as well, um, I'm just trying to organize things a little bit. Let's go ahead and throw this over here. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, remove this custom connection because I don't think that she's the killer anymore. I think that this type AA is very definitely the killer. Okay, well, that was a good find. Uh, I hate doing this because it means I get the stinky trait, but I'm going to look through the uh, garbage. Nothing. Nothing in there. So, um, let's play a game, huh? Uh, where's my nerd book? Here we go. I don't seem to have a pen anymore. Oh, there's a pen. What do you think this is? It looks like there's a dot here. It's kind of hard to parse that out. There's only... There's only one vowel. So I have to assume... I have to assume that this is a name. Um, finding the first letter would probably be more helpful than finding this, the second letter. I feel like this is a name. Three, four, five. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Let, let's, let's look at other avenues before we get into that because I, I that could be anything i'm pretty sure it's a name but um parsing it out is going to be really difficult because like 
Yeah, I, I don't know about that one. Okay, wait, staff. Uh, work rota. Work ID. Let's check out the dragon burger. Take our uh, grenade. Hello, officer. Um, it would have been nice if we'd gotten fingerprints on any of those cartridges. Didn't look like we did. I do wish uh, maybe there's an easier or better way of... Oh, you know what I didn't... I always forget to do this part is... Um, I didn't check the phone number. Like, uh, who called last. That's one thing I, I've been not good about doing. Um, 1502. Well, something we could do is check out uh, security. I, I really wasn't as thorough as I wanted to be. You know what? Let's check out Dra Dragon Burger first. Type A, B. Type P. You never know. Maybe, maybe we get lucky and we find a, a double A. Whoa, Oni Johnson. I remember Oni Johnson. Isn't he dead? Okay, let's um put this away for now. Oh, that that looks kind of like a visual glitch. I know it's not, but it, it looks a little bit like it. So there's our Charlotte Penna. We've got some more information on her. Anika Sharma. Raquel Crutcher. Rhea Maru Maruyama. Oscar Nielsen. And uh, this is kind of what happened last time. But I'm just going to check. Did we find out what our double A is? And no, we didn't. It's just worth uh, checking, you know, like sometimes the person that they work with is just like, you know, ends up being the person. Okay, I'm going to put this over here. We got fingerprints and now we have Dragon Burger over here. Um, code door to my office has been reset. 0510. There's no one here. I'm assuming that uh, we're, you know, this is uh, Charlotte's shift. Oh, five, ten. Oh, hello. Just wondering, is there any interactivity with the toilet? I was, I was just wondering. Um, can we knock on this? Hello. Hey, bud. Can I have a look around? How much for a tour of the place? Sure, I can issue a temporary guest pass, but it will cost you. That's fine. How much? Nice. Two hours. Good enough. I always like to check the safe. Um, oh, five, ten. Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, five, ten. There we go. Anything in here? Some documents. Paper stack. Uh, you, I guess there's nothing in that paper stack worth looking at. It went ahead and did me the service of uh, logging me in. Here, bud. 
Sales records. Let's have a quick look through here. Trisha Mande, there she is again. But it, you know, I don't think there's all that many, uh, I don't think that's of any interest. And just to familiarize yourself, we're put, looking for Dane Beckford or Charlotte, Charlotte Penna. So I guess Penna is more um, relevant. I'm not really seeing anything. So let's look at the surveillance. We'll look uh, for Charlotte Penna. And I guess we're looking when, I know we're not looking for when she died, obviously, but uh, you know, maybe the same day, at least Wednesday. We're still on Wednesday. Uh, okay, so wait, isn't that our person? No, not even close. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything. Uh, let me just double check. 1630. But what's her work rota? Uh, 6 to 18, Monday to Thursday. So in theory, she should have been working on Wednesday. Is this unknown? Oscar Nielsen, the retail owner. Lynn Schubert. Unknown citizen. Okay, let's have a quick look at Tuesday. Yeah, this isn't really helping too much. Oh, there, there's Charlotte Penna. Oh, she was here. She she did her job. Not really much to follow up on there. I mean, someone came in and used the phone. I don't think that that's worth following up on either. Employee database. Tenna. Wait, type Z. Did we know that? I have to assume we did know that. Okay, um... Yeah, I don't think that this is necessarily very helpful. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get my job in order. Raven Sia. About later. This is uh, all to do with Oscar Nielsen. Oscar Nielsen doesn't seem to be anyone very important. Okay, um... Oh, this place is closed now. Okay. Yeah, let's let's get out of here. This, um, this doesn't seem to... This seems to be kind of a dead end. I, I feel like definitely checking up on this um, black market would be a good idea. So where is that work rota? Right there. Work rota weapons dealer. Do we know where she works? 
We don't have her fingerprints, by the way. I mean, we... I think we can safely assume that she's type Y. Let's play. Uh, outside of, like, looking up all of these letters, like, the consonants specifically, looking for a, uh... A name in the directory. I don't know what I'm going to be doing with this. Crumpled paper found at 1502 Stubbs Deluxe. Let's uh, let's go back to Stubbs Deluxe and um, look at the phone because it's something I didn't do. And then maybe also look at uh, the security camera, which is also something I should do. I always forget that part of it. You want to look at, like, the last, um, phone call that was made. I wasn't able to do it in the last mission. Because it, it looked like, um, it just wasn't available. I mean, I went on a wild goose chase and, and ended up on Trisha Mande. You know, truth be told, I don't remember seeing a, a telephone in here. Wait, is that more spent cartridges? Good lord. There were a lot of guns, uh, you know, guns fired. Shots fired. I should really check up on, like, all of these. Something I should have done also is like look under the bed. Uh, it doesn't seem to be anything interesting under there. My inventory is full. I keep running into this problem. Let's drop uh, a sync disc for a moment. Did it just fall through the floor? Oh no, it's right there. Okay, I'm gonna take this and see if I can find um, fingerprints on it. Nope. Outside of like picking up every single one of those, I don't know if I'd like. Oh, I guess it's uh, hanging in in thin air now. So, do we not have a phone plate in this place? Don't you have phones? I could get a number cruncher and see if I can break into uh, Charlotte Penna's um, account. That is always an option. Wouldn't be too expensive. Uh oh. Uh oh, whoops. Almost got caught by the poli police. The polis. A lot of clothing on the ground. Um. Weapons dealer. Work rota. I've really like looked at everything in here and not I'm not able to find basically anything. Anything helpful anyway. Uh, oh, there's the phone. Oh, finally. Okay. Anything in here? Start uh, call up grieving. Okay, that's not helpful. Address book. Maybe we can find, um, someone that matches this crumpled paper here. Crumpled paper. Let's play a game. 
Uh, it's difficult to make out this handwriting. Raquel, uh, Anika, no, Raven, Ramja, no, I'm looking for a U, something, something that has a U in there. Jabari, Dama, Neil, Tess, Agnes, GM, Tony, Alamer, Mia, Oscar, Cam, Callie, Holly, nothing in here, Enzo, Julie, no, Julie's almost there, Glenna, okay, so none of these names even come close to matching what is in here in the crumpled paper. What is this 501 Stubbs Deluxe? 1501 Stubbs Deluxe. I did notice that the police officer was uh, knocking on the fifth on 1501. Hmm. Okay. Well, we're gonna keep the address book for now. And um, let's take check out the telephone, dial numbers, uh, identify the phone number. I think I already knew the phone number, but that's fine. I guess I didn't. Hang up. Okay, pick up, dial. Identify last caller. What are these other numbers? Hmm. Okay, let's uh, identify the last caller. Unable to get last caller information. This happened last time. Do I have the number for this 501 Stubbs Deluxe? I do. answer okay well that's interesting um we should follow up on that i mean we should definitely f see if we can't find dana becca oopsie daisy Somebody in the lobby? I'm just gonna just gonna go ahead and lock pick this door right in front of the camera. Quickly enough that I can do it. Uh oh. We're cool, right? They were over here. <laughs> they sure were. You are not wrong. Mm, that's not, that's like straight up not working. Uh, I want to get into this apartment. I should have done it while the camera wasn't looking at the very least. Whoopsie daisy. Okay, we've got a crumpled paper. Nothing, nothing on that, okay. Matchbook. Um, you know what? Let's check for fingerprints. What do we got here? AF. Okay, well, mm, that rules this place out. AG. 
Nothing of real interest here. AG. AF. Okay, well... What is this? Hearing aid. You can't help me, uh, uh blame me for, for suspecting that this place was involved. It's... It seems kind of suspicious. A little bit, anyway. The fact that they're not answering the phone... Um... It's listed as a as an address. Uh oh. Okay. Can I take some prints? Search. It's always difficult to, to take prints from someone when they're sleeping. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that was spooky. Well, I don't know. I, I guess I'll leave it here for now. Um, there's a couple of leads I can follow up on. Um, we're looking for, we're looking for Dane Beckford. We're looking for this double A. We're looking for someone that matches this name. I was kind of hoping it would be in the address book, but it really doesn't seem like it is. Just giving it a cursory gl glance, it, it, it really just doesn't seem like it. Unless... One, unless these are the first names, there's that option as well. I, I didn't realize that, but we could like go through them one by one and like try and find someone with a last name that matches this. Um, it could be, be that these are the first names and I have to go through like, okay, someone that begins with uh, J, I don't know, J Jabari. Um, if they had a last name that matches the less, rest of the letters, th there could be something there, but... Uh, that seems like a lot of work, I won't lie. Um, so I'll leave it here. If you're enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button. Consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.